up YouTube, Jason here, Morphinology Reptiles. Welcome back to the channel. We got another clutch of eggs to pull today. This will be clutch three for us. And uh, actually, kind of a surprise. I've got some other females in here that I thought would have laid a while ago. So uh, this one I didn't think was quite ready. Although the date on her tub says 418. And uh, at the time of filming, this is 417. So I guess she is right on the schedule. Uh, but before we do that, I want to show you something really cool here. Check this out. Our girl Nala just recently shed in one big, beautiful piece. How cool is that? She's right down here. I'll turn the lights on so you can see her. She's looking freaking awesome. Now you gotta remember, you can't measure the sheds to know how long your uh, snake is because they stretch quite a bit when they're shedding. Uh, but I have had Nala out and she measures right around six and a half foot or so. Uh, six, six and a half foot right in there. But look at that, just super cool. Also wanted to update you guys real quick on Harvey from the last video. He's doing really well. Look awesome in this cage, so I'm really excited about that. But that's not why we're here today. You guys are here to see another clutch being pulled. Uh, this one I'm super excited about actually because uh, it's a project that I kind of jumped into late and got some help from some buddies. I'll talk about that in a minute, but I'm really hoping it proves uh, it proves out and we get some really cool stuff out of this. The female is this girl right here, Morticia. She's a Huffman Het Hypo. I'll give you a quick preview. <laughs> Wound up nice and tight on some burly whites. Beautiful little ball. Not the biggest snake we have by any means, uh, this lane. She's about 17, 1800 grams or whatever. But like I said, she's a Huffman Het Hypo. We bred her to this guy, Jack. And Jack's kind of a cool story. This is a, what they refer to as a black pearl, which is a black pastel Huffman. And he is possible head hypo, 66%. So the cool thing about Jack here is he came from, if you remember, he came from uh, Joel at State 48 Exotics. Joel sent him over to me because uh, he had bought Jack three years ago, something like that, for the Huffman and Black Pastel Hypo project. Uh, but he bought it as a female. And three years later, after he got to, you know, 800, 1200 grams, something like that, it wasn't getting any bigger and wasn't trying to breed, he pro uh, popped him again, found out Jack's actually a male and it uh, didn't fit into his projects because he doesn't need more males. So uh, he and I worked out a deal and Jack came over here. So hopefully we prove him out head hypo and we get some super Huffman hypo and what's referred to as a slick. I'll put up a picture right here. Basically a slick is a visual hypo version of, of Jack there. It's a black pastel Huffman hypo, but they just look really cool. And this is our only shot at hitting a slick in this case because Black Pastel and Huffman are allelic. They're part of the Black Pastel uh, allele complex. So in the case of the slick, he can only pass on either Black Pastel or Huffman, but not both at the same time. So for instance, we also put him to Peggy this hypo pinstripe female who's getting ready to lay here any day now. This is a breeder loan uh, with my buddy Brian at Sailor Serpents. 
and I was hoping to get some originally uh, before I started doing some more research and learning how the allele worked uh, I was hoping for some pinstripe slicks well that's not possible in this case because Jack can only give either Black Pastel or Huffman, but not both. So my only shot at slicks this year is this clutch that we are pulling today. Uh, I think that the slick is awesome. I think the Super Huffman Hypo is gonna be sweet. So fingers crossed that he proves out hit and uh, we get some really cool stuff here. But let's go ahead and pull Morticia's clutch out and see how many eggs we got in there and what we're working with for our slick project this year. which she is like I said not a huge girl but uh, laid for us a beautiful clutch of five pearly whites they look great no slugs we'll of course candle them and make sure that the veins look good and set them up in our easy hatch trays <laughs> guys got five pearly whites in here had to separate them or I, I wanted to separate them for the easy hatch trays obviously uh, they're pretty well stuck together so these were probably laid last night uh, it's about noon my time so uh, they were pretty well put together this one's got kind of weak looking veins but they've got decent veins throughout they all look pretty good so all we do is put the lid on it Five egg zero slugs, do 612. Let's see if I can do this one handed here. We'll slide them right in here with the rest of them. All right, guys, there you go. This video has probably gone on long enough anyway, so. I'm gonna get her tub totally cleaned out, scrubbed really well, new bedding put in, get her set back up and uh, hopefully right on food and we'll get right back to it. Again, Black Pastel Huffman Possible Head Hypo to a Huffman Head Hypo. Super excited about what we could hit here. So, fingers crossed, 56 days. We'll take a look at what we got and uh, go from there. More clutches to come. I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.